Aloha! Or as we like to say, Aloha! <laughs> uh, <clears throat> What's up, guys? Welcome to Mario Odyssey Versus. My name is Attacking Toucans. <laughs> and my name is Josh Jepson. How's it going, everybody? I'm doing very good, Juanita Jepson. I wasn't asking you. <laughs> oh, dang. Rude. I was asking already, the audience who I already care coming about way more at than me. You. Come on, yeah. we gotta. This is you a competition, come... man. The... Just because it's a competition doesn't mean you have to be mean to me. What? <laughs> Isn't that how it works? I thought that's the whole point of this entire channel, is me being mean to you. <laughs> I guess that's fair I enough. Been, I was gonna say, we could have good sportsmanship, but eh, whatever. Oh no, no. Screw that noise. <laughs> Anyways, welcome guys. So we are doing a versus of this game. If you were, for some reason, new to versus, I don't know why I said it for some reason. If you have not been watching versus, <laughs> your life is pathetic and you need to... <laughs> no, just kidding. Um, you're, if you're wrong. <laughs> You've been wrong your whole life. Uh, if you're new to Versa, what we do is we are racing through this game fairly casually. Josh and I have both beaten this game, but this is a casual race through the game. And we are doing yep. a darker side run. Yes, so that means that we're going to be collecting 503 moons in total. So we can get any moon that we want to get throughout the game, uh, but we have to unlock the darker side, do the <gasps> darker side. Mario's the there. Oh no! How could this happen? Wait, who is this? Marshmallow? <laughs> <laughs> it's Marshmallow Man, you know? The new hero of the game. Mario's dead, so. <laughs> Rest in pieces. Uh, we're also going to be giving away two copies of Mario Odyssey uh, Hell yeah. throughout the series. So what you gotta, all you have to do is go down into the description, follow us on Twitter. There's, our links are down in the description. Uh, and there's some other information about uh, tweeting out uh, the hashtag Mario Odyssey Versus with the, uh, a link to the, to the first episode of the series. Yeah, it's a way to help. It's a way to um, enter in for a free chance to win the game, and also a way just to help promote the series. So yeah, if, you guys, if you guys want to help promote the series, just just enter into the description. And if also, if you already own Odyssey, if you win the competition, we will buy you that Nintendo credit so you can buy <laughs> whatever game you want. You can get anything you want, man. <laughs> you can have whatever you like. Josh, also, how come uh, Cappy has the same hairstyle as you? I know, right? I know, I noticed that. He has the freaking same hair as me, dude. Also, I, I skipped it. I skipped that cutscene too. Just so you, we are skipping cutscenes apart from that opening cutscene, just so everybody right. knows. Apart we only, we only showed the opening cutscene because it's like the only cutscene of the game that actually includes like story to it. Yeah, you know, Princess Peach gets captured by Bowser again, I guess. Again. <laughs> again. Except this time except this time he's trying to marry her. He's trying to wife her, dude. Dude, I know. Princess and Peach is like, not wife material. She is literally, no. like, I don't even think she, I'm not even, what skills does Princess Peach possess? Like, what, does she even a good, I guess, or does she just have that grade A puss, I mean. <laughs> <laughs> she has, she has that peach emoji on her bum. Is that, is, I guess, well, yeah, I guess. I guess. That's why the peach emoji looks like, uh, looks like a booty. It's, it's based it, off of Princess based, Peach, inspired it's, yeah, by. It's based on, it's inspired by her ass. <laughs> <laughs> I'm always inspired by ass, dude. <laughs> ass is just like, it's, ass is just inspirational. I don't know what it is. It's just it's, something it's about what it. Keeps me going, man. It's what keeps me going in this dude. in this hard life. In 2018, that's gonna be the motive of all ass. <laughs> the year of ass. Oh, speaking of which, before we get too far into this episode, too, I I, I want to mention that uh, we uh, we want people to race along with us. Hell yeah. Okay, so that's like something we did in the original Mario Sunshine Versus, and people have been requesting for us to bring it back, and I was just thinking we should hardcore like bring back the community aspect of racing, because yeah. we're trying to build more of a community amongst this kind of thing. So if you guys want to be a part of this Versus with us, um, so we're uploading these videos every Saturday, 30-minute um, yep. episodes. If you want to race along, just upload your videos, uh, and then... Uh, pretty much just race along with us and you can do commentary or whatever you want and link it to us on Twitter And we will be retweeting and shouting out some of you guys' races along with us Because we want to give other let's players We know how hard it is to like try to be noticed in the let's play community nowadays It yeah. is difficult and so we're actually we are trying to do our best to give some people an opportunity in a platform to Have some audience and to bring some community amongst us. Hell so, yeah 
And, and it's, it's all inspired by uh, the Jeff Squad. Who is going to win? If you're on the Jeff Squad, by the way, go down and leave a comment saying that you're on the Jeff Squad. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and if you're on the Two Clan, apparently just kill yourself. <laughs> Oh, Mario has a fucking wire going through him, dude. That looks so painful. Oh, this opening, this title screen, though, dude. It's beautiful, dude. I'm so happy. Dude, Honestly, the first so time, good. the first time I saw this, like, it brought like a tear to my eye. And you know what? The Cascade Kingdom is the best possible first level that they could have done. Like the actual first real level in the game. It's, it's phenomenal. So good. Oh, I forgot. I can. It's fantastic. I forgot how many cutscenes there are to skip in this game. Like I'm just I not know, used right? to it. I'm like, okay, I have to like get used to like skipping all these cutscenes because I'm not used to like I've, I've never sped run this game. I've watched speed runs of this game, but I'm like not super familiar with every single possible like cutscene skip. Yeah, I've been I've been waiting to do the speed run until after we've done this versus so that I like I don't like dominate you. <laughs> I don't like the way you phrase that. Dominate? You don't want to be dominated by me, Tyler? Um, Ooh. Not really. <laughs> oh, if we're being good. if we're being honest. <laughs> good, because I didn't plan on it. <laughs> Zaddy Jepson. That does not have a ring to it. I hope that's never Dude, said what? to anybody. Gross. What did you say? What, what does Zaddy mean? What does that mean? <laughs> you don't know what Zaddy means, dude? I have no idea what that means. No. I don't. I don't think anybody knows actually. <laughs> I was just, just taking the word daddy and putting a Z in front of it, and for some reason that makes it more fun to say Zaddy. But you didn't make that up, did you? No. Okay. Could I take credit for it? You can, yeah, sure, because I'm, I'm pff, shit, I wouldn't know. <laughs> I'm trying to decide if I want to do T-Rex skip or not. I mean, there's not really a point, because we have to get a lot of moons anyways, so there's not really a point to doing, like, skips of, I'm gonna like, do moons. It. You are? <laughs> yeah, I'm going to do it. Fuck Just it. to show your pro strats, dude? Just to show my pro strats. Have you ever okay. done it before? I've never tried to do it, but I'm going to try, actually, as well. I've done it one time. It's not that diff difficult to do. Oh, also, fucking, if you're part of the Two Clan, let, let me know in the comments below that you're representing Two Clan, guys. We gotta have some of that Two Clan representation. <laughs> I like how you forgot to do that. I'm over yeah. here, like, talking about the Jeff Squad. <laughs> yeah, I was, I couldn't let you get away with that. I had to. Oh, f oh, sure God, no. Oh, I messed it up. We just oh, have one big sleepy boy, dude. Oh, I messed it up. One giant sleepy boy. One big sleepy boy. This is one small step for man. One, one giant leap for dinosaur kind. No, what? Ah, ah, damn it! I don't know how to leave my capture. I like. Did, yeah, that, that was did, my fault. That was I my problem I did the T-Rex jump, and I like. Don't wait. What button is it? What button is it? What button is it? It's, no, it's, I didn't do it. ZL, bro. I can't. What? I didn't. I'm not You're good panicking. enough at this game. You're panicking, think, dude. That's because I'm at the disco, man. Panic at the disco. Did it's I good hope? Shit, man. I hope he releases a new album this year. No, step on the trampoline, you actual boob monkey. Come on. You actual <laughs> boob. This is this is going terribly. I'm off to a terrible start right now. Good. I'm glad That's you what I like I, to hear. I'm glad you suck at video games. No! Okay, I'm I give so up. Bad, I give up. Dude. I give up. <laughs> I give up. You I'm give not up? Gonna, Wait, I'm not, I did it already. <laughs> I'm not trying to do the T-Rex stuff. I don't need to. There's other moons I can get anyways. Like, why That's am I true. trying to go for that? Like, I need to get the moons regardless. Oh my gosh, this is embarrassing. <laughs> this is freaking embarrassing. Like, there's literally, there's probably, there's thousands of people just watching me suck, like, anal fissures <laughs> right now. Ew! What? <laughs> what? How is that what you went to? Anal fissures? I don't even, I don't even like thinking about that. <laughs> I don't either. I don't know why I said it. But for some reason, I say lots of, like, my parents always taught me to think before I speak. <laughs> yet, did they really? Because it didn't yet, work. Yeah, yet I still never fully, like, it, didn't work. it never fully clicked for me. You know, <laughs> I never uh, learned so that life lesson. The multi-moons, I'm taking this in a different direction. Uh, the multi-moons are called, in Japanese, they're called grand moons. But if you, if you switch the game to Japanese, they so, say grand moons. It's Isn't a weird? grand old moon, it's a high-flying moon. And forever in peace may we live. What the heck? I just... <laughs> Maybe we leave? There's way too many freaking chain shops right now. It's bursting my balls, dude. Bursting my balls. That's kind of gross. Sound, I have... Actually. I don't know where all of these just, like, figures of speech are coming from today. <laughs> it's just, The verses brings it out of me, man. It brings out the weirdness. <laughs> brings out the weirdness. Which, I mean, I, I think that's the best thing about verses, actually. Is, like, all the... The, the actual, like, our, our the side of our personality that comes out when we're on verses it's so much different it is honestly for some reason commentating with you 
brings out a side of me that doesn't normally exist. Same. Same. And I've gotten worse over the years. I've got, <laughs> I've become more like you over the years. It's kind of disturbing. I, for some reason, I get really just, I think it's so adorable when the Chain Chomp is wearing, like, the fabulous, like, pink hat. <laughs> <laughs> just so glamorized. So glamorous! It, it reminds me of my favorite thing on the Wheel of Torture that I can't wait to talk about, the Gucci Gang Lifeline. <laughs> oh my god, the Gucci Gang Lifeline. We can actually talk about it now, because it's going to happen here in five minutes, so we can actually okay, yeah, let's go, go ahead and introduce our, our life. They're not called lifelines. I don't know why I'm saying the word lifeline, because we've honestly, we have, we have done verses like lifelines in the past. I've never understood yeah. why we call them lifelines. Cause, yeah, because they've always been hindrances. They're never, they've never been actual lifelines like that are helpful. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I guess they're so, lifelines for me, because it helps me out that, it, that you suck, but I don't... <laughs> that's true, yeah. But it's just, it, it, it's not what they are, so we're calling them something different now. We're calling it the Wheel of Torture, and uh, the way that it works is basically uh, we're going to randomly generate one of five uh, torture things. <laughs> I don't know what to <laughs> yeah. call them. Uh, and... We could still call them lifelines. I mean, we can just we use that word. Because it yeah, is, people know what we're lifeline. talking about. Like, that's the that's the purpose of speech, yeah. is to convey a message. And it, yeah. the message is being conveyed. <laughs> the, the message is being conveyed! Also, I went around the long way expecting to get some moons. I don't think I got any moons from going the long way. I literally just, like, lost, like... I just got five minutes behind just by sucking. Just because I suck. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I couldn't that's do okay. I'm probably going to suck even worse, to be honest. It's okay. I... I this is going to be a pretty long versus, so I'm, I'm sure something's going to happen to you to give me a chance to catch back up. Yeah. So, uh, for the Wheel of Torture, by the way, uh, the, the different lifelines that we have on the Wheel of Torture are... Uh, we have Switch, which we actually like, literally have to switch the two controllers in our hands. Switch, um, switch, bitch. And we, it's also, you know, get. it's on the Switch. It's kind of funny. Uh, <laughs> I get it! We called yeah. it the Switch! Because we're that playing hilarious? on the Switch! Oh my god! Oh, <laughs> uh, shut up. <laughs> um, so we have euthanize, which is we literally just have to we have to kill Mario. That's, that's it. I wanted I wanted Mario. I wanted to name the lifeline kill yourself, but we, Josh said that was a bit distasteful. So we ended up going with something a bit more tame. <laughs> Euthanization. <laughs> Um, you can tell which one's Tyler named and which ones I named. Uh, the next oh. one's called two player, uh, where we have to switch to two player mode. Uh, Which that's is for really, the rest of the episode, right? I tested it out just to see what it would be like. It is really weird playing a two-player. Yeah. So we have to do that for the rest of the episode. Uh, then we... I want to introduce the next one. Okay, the next fine. lifeline is Gucci Gang, Gucci Gang, Gucci Gang. I know the reference is already like way old, but we literally haven't made a versus video since Gucci Gang became a thing. So I'm still throwing in the reference because we got <laughs> to promote Lil Pump. Josh. Lil Pump? <laughs> that <laughs> that's a fucking... That's his name. name. What the fuck did I just click? Oh, yeah. Pump. Wait, Josh. How much? What's up? How much syrup does a SoundCloud rapper add to their coffee whenever they go to Starbucks? A little uh, pump. <laughs> oh, fuck you! <laughs> <laughs> I was like, where is this going? I don't know how I didn't see where it was going, considering you just said it. <laughs> <laughs> I, yeah, I literally said the punchline before I made the joke. Yeah. That's not no, how jokes work, Tyler. That's actually that's a joke I made on t my Twitter like about a about a month ago, like right before my Twitter account was suspended by that one dude who got my Twitter yeah. taken down. If you guys have don't know Fuck about my guy, Twitter situation, way. oh my god, I am so pissed. Um, I yeah, made a video about it. I don't want to discuss it on the verses. There's a video on my channel where I discussed why my Twitter was suspended. It yeah. is complete bullcrap. Like I was I was literally attacked, and Twitter is just not helping me <laughs> because they have terrible customer support. Yeah, t yeah, Twitter's never been really one for customer support at all. I mean, that's what happens when you're a service that, like, a p that millions and millions of people are using. Like, it's hard. Like, there's really... And for, for Twitter, it makes sense not to have that much customer support because it's just a lot of yeah. expenses and stuff. But it's still just dumb. Like, I'm literally thinking about just going to San Francisco, walking in... Wait, <laughs> first, first I gotta get the... Can I talk to a manager haircut? Um, <laughs> because... <laughs> wait, wait, what is that haircut? <laughs> like, like 40 year old middle aged woman who just was really pissed off and wants to speak to a manager. Oh, gotcha. Okay. Um, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go to the Twitter headquarters and request to talk to a manager and get. I my mean, you already account. look like a 40 year old woman, so it works out. Oh, that's like the nicest thing you've ever said to me. <laughs> Is <I've>, it? <laughs> You say lots of mean things to me, so that's probably the nicest thing you've said to me. That's true. I guess it is. 
I don't know, when we were drunk that one time in that one episode of Mario Sunshine vs. Uh, it was, uh, I, said, I said a lot of nice things. Yeah, for some reason, people are nice to me when they're drunk. I'm just nice in general when I'm drunk. Me too. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a good drunk. Some people are nice drunks, some people are mean drunks, some people are horny drunks. I'm a horny drunk. I, yeah, me too. I just want to fuck everything when I'm drunk. Oh, God. <laughs> everything? Everything. I see, I literally see, like, a couch, and I'm like, ooh, that's a <laughs> sexy fuck couch. Fuck your couch. <laughs> <laughs> that's such a weird a, concept. I know. Isn't that a reference to something? Like, uh, yeah, uh, I, oh, I don't remember. It's an old reference. I think it has something to do with Halo. Something Maybe. about fuck, fucking your couch. I just remember saying, fuck your couch a lot on Halo. <laughs> like online, I would just say it to the microphone. Fuck your Wait, couch! Oh my gosh, it's, it's time for the time for the wheel of torture, dude. Oh shit! Okay. I never All explained right. the I never explained the Gucci gang. So Gucci gang, if that lifeline comes up, we both have to buy an outfit with the purple coins. Okay. Because we don't of which, we don't have to collect the, the purple coins in this game unless that lifeline comes up. Okay, so here is the wheel of torture. We've actually already randomly generated it just now, uh, and it actually is Gucci gang. <laughs> Gucci gang. Oh my god. <laughs> so now we have to collect. Uh, <laughs> However enough purple coins to, coin, to get an things. outfit. Which sucks, because I, I haven't been collecting them, and I should It's have. actually probably one of the hardest ones to do for this first episode. <laughs> <coughs> yeah, it really is, actually. Wait, so, like, when when do we have to get the outfit by? Like, when's our deadline? Uh, or about you have to get it before you go... How about you just have to get it before you go to the next world? Does that work? Uh, yeah. Yeah, let's do that. Sure. Okay. Because I'm not... Because it's kind of, like, weird. Like, it, you still have to get it, but, like... You don't have to get it instantly. Yeah, like, if, and if you don't get it be before the end of the episode or whatever... That's what I'm saying, because it's not always possible to get that many purple coins, depending right, on where Right, it'll you just are. carry over into the next episode. Yeah, but it's just something you have to do. Yeah. That we didn't, we didn't have to do it, but now we do have to do it. Yeah, that's that's how things work, Tyler. <laughs> <laughs> I like it. We so didn't we, have to... <laughs> we, had, we didn't explain didn't the very last lifeline, by the way. What's that? Oh, yeah, we the last lifeline is... Moon Goon. <laughs> <laughs> Guess which one's Tyler named? <laughs> uh, moon Goon, which is we have to switch worlds um, and collect three moons that we've already collected. Uh, we can't do that obviously this first episode, which is I mean, so it was only, that was not the, that was the only one not in the running. Um, yeah, which but, is why we didn't even explain it until afterwards. Right. Yeah. So that's the it's, only. It's other not, not going to take effect until next episode because we can't every episode of the really. series will have all of the lifelines or all of the torture. Lines in the, uh, in the <laughs> called the one eight hundred torture hotline today. <laughs> torture hotline to get your the hot torturing <laughs> from a sexy German lady near what? you. What? <laughs> okay, I'm, I'm down. trying to reference like it. German dungeon porn or whatever that shit is. I'm, I'm calling it right now, Tyler. <laughs> <laughs> That's my favorite phone number. Yeah. See, there's logic, and he's like, he's gonna make a song. He made a song promoting the suicide hotline. Then there's me promoting the German dungeon porn hotline, because that's who I am as a person. German dungeon porn? <laughs> you are d German dungeon porn as a as a person. You're personified dungeon porn. Mm. <laughs> that's what I like. That's how good. I'm glad. What is my existence, Josh? Literally dungeon porn. Apparently. <laughs> why? Why is our life just so memey? Just. Literally, our lives are jokes at this point. How do you it's feel true. about that? Oh my gosh, uh, this guy is. This dude is so okay with that. cool. Hell yeah. Wait, who's cool? Dude, the, you should already know who I'm talking about. The coolest character in Mario Odyssey. I don't have any idea what you're talking about. Mr. Sunglasses, dude. Mr. Sun. Wait. Oh, you're. Oh, you decided to go to the next world. Oh. Wait, See, are you still in Cascade? I decided to go back to Cascade and get a bunch of moons in there. Isn't Cascade the name of like a, like a dishwashing pod? <laughs> yes, yeah, like Tide Pods. Yeah. yeah, is that the is that could be the next challenge? Is the Cascade yeah. Pod challenge? Yeah, we gotta eat Cascade Pods. Nah, Wait, is Tyler. that can that be can that be the um loser challenge? Is loser has to eat <laughs> the Cascade Pod? No, <laughs> push pushing forward, <laughs> but you have to swallow. No. You can't just spit it out like a fucking pussy. You have to actually swallow. <laughs> <laughs> Like a pussy. Dude, you spitter, know, you spitters are quitters. <laughs> spitters are quitters. <laughs> Gross. No, Tyler. No, that's not a thing we're doing. We're not oh. eating pods of oh. any kind. We're gonna use common sense. That's no fun. Yeah. No. Common sense. Common sense is where it's at, man. That's that's how you live. That's Dude. how you go through life and live. Dude, it's 2018. You can't make it on YouTube by using common sense nowadays. 
<laughs> you know what? The sad thing is, is that's completely true. <laughs> oh, it's it's that is it is the sad thing. It's so sad. Welcome it is sad. It's like literally sad because the things that people become famous on YouTube for nowadays are things that the YouTube community would have literally shunned you for, like yeah. five years ago. Right? That's so freaking nuts, dude. Like it's we literally nuts. we started a point like five years ago on YouTube to where if your thumbnail was even slightly slightly misleading people would inst like you were instantly just kind of like viewed as like kind of a piece of shit in a way but now yeah. you literally have to make clickbaity thumbnails in order for people to even notice you in general like it's become wow. like the social norm on youtube nowadays but used to be considered it's so not sad. okay it is sad it's so sad it's like uh this is this is on a smaller scale because this has nothing to do with like youtube as a whole but within the let's play community if you remember like once upon a time uh i was like one of the first let's players to get <laughs> once partnered. upon a time not long ago i was a hoe. <laughs> sorry yeah yep that's you definitely uh, no and, sorry. and so i had the ability to upload 30 minute videos and i did because i had that ability so i was like why not let's do it and uh People just shat on me, and now it's the norm for gaming content to be like. Now, now if your videos longer. aren't 30 minutes, people are like, "What the hell? Why the short video, man?" <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. What's going it's on? Crazy. You trying to you trying to milk shit? <laughs> trying to you trying to milk shit? You trying to milk me? Trying to grab my? Never mind. I'm not even. I'm not even gonna take it there. I'm not even gonna take it there. I started to, and I cut myself off. <laughs> oh shoot! Wait, wait, hang on. What I'm in the cast. I can't. I can't buy. I can't buy the outfit in the Cascade place yet. Oh, just buy it. Just buy it. Oh, I just. But I have. The to, I've already recol. I've already collected all the fucking coins. God damn it! When does I'll that? Just, when does just that because. Just here? because the lifelines are kind of weird for this very first episode, I'll let it slide. You can go back and buy that outfit later on. We'll just keep track of it. Okay. Just make sure you good. do it next time you go to the Cascade. You make sure you buy a Cascade outfit. Like that's just something you have to okay. do at some point. Do I have to? Does it appear if I leave and come back? I have no idea when I'm not. I, I guess don't know I have shop appears. I guess it probably does once I leave and come back. So I'll yeah. probably. Just One of the reasons we didn't that. instantly jump on Mario Odyssey for reverses is because we did want to play through the yeah. game a couple times. We wanted to like we wanted everybody to have a chance to like love the game, become acquainted with it, have their own experiences before we jumped in. Because we knew if we started from the very like when the game came out, there'd be a lot be of a people, lot of people alienated because. Yeah. So we wanted to like keep that in regard. There's still probably going to be a lot of people that can't watch because it is a still relatively new game. But yeah. we and wanted to wait still a little have a bit. Switch. If also, you don't have a Switch, go get a Switch because they're amazing. Oh yes, dude. Switch is. It's I just so I'm good. actually I'm just so excited for this versus dude because I have so much I want to talk about. Like there is so much to talk about what's, in this series. It's insane. What's, what's your favorite aspect of this game? My favorite aspect. I just love yeah. that it's open world. Like the fact that they brought back the fact that there's not just like straight emissions to do. Cause that was like my least favorite thing about like Mario 3D World is every single level was so linear. And that's not, yeah. I mean, Mario Galaxy is kind of okay because it's still, Mario Galaxy it still had a sort of open world element to it. There was some more linear levels, but it didn't, Mario Odyssey you, you, didn't feel very linear. I'm not, sorry, did I say Odyssey yeah. all that time? You said, you said Odyssey that entire time. <laughs> I meant to say, I meant to say Galaxy. Girl, all just like, I'll do a voiceover in editing. <laughs> like a really <laughs> shitty, be like, that Mario <laughs> Galaxy. <laughs> it was like really abrupt and like obvious. What if um, I did it for you and you just dubbed <laughs> my voice over yours? <laughs> Let's do it. Let's do it. Okay. Crouch. Galaxy. <laughs> that'll that'll be the go. one to use. Anyway, so yeah, Mario Galaxy. It was a linear game, but it didn't feel very linear. Like when I played uh, Galaxy, I didn't feel like it was a linear experience. Oh, like then 3D World felt super linear and I was kind of like not super into that experience too much. Like I liked 3D World, but I didn't love 3D World. Yeah, I definitely like the less linear experiences. Yeah. Oh so, shit, I did I fucked it up again. Yeah. So that's my favorite thing about Odyssey is the fact that we've gotten back to a point where the games aren't straight up just linear. I like being able to explore. I love it gives you just that sense of exploration. Like yeah. I am so envious of children right now who get to play this game. <laughs> I know something about the something about that statement was really funny to me. <laughs> I'm just envious of children. <laughs> no, but can you imagine playing this game as a kid? I know that would be amazing, dude. Like I wish so bad I could play this as a child. I almost, I just want to have a kid now just so I can have them play this game and see how they like experience it through them. Yeah. Yeah. It'd be amazing. But you yeah, know what I you know what I mean by that? Like yeah, like no, envious I, of children. It just to, sounds funny. <laughs> it does sound funny. <laughs> I'm like, 
So I've only I've beaten this game twice now, but I've still like have not played it enough to the points where I like know exactly what I'm doing. So it's, it still feels like like I haven't memorized this game by any means yet. Some of the earlier some of the earlier moons are like I'm gonna start getting confused between the ones because there's like some post game moons that you can't get until after you've beaten the final boss. And so I'm gonna start getting confused between those ones because that's the ones that I've been collecting most recently. Yeah. So and I've also watched a lot of things related to this game. Like I've watched lots of speedruns, but like speedrunners don't do a majority of the game. So like a majority of the things we're doing. It's true. Should have watched the darker side run. Yeah. <laughs> as mysterious as the darker side of the moon. Sorry, I have, a, I, have an obsession, I have an obsession with breaking out into Mulan songs. Is that is that so? <laughs> Dude, they're making a freaking live action Mulan movie, and I am ecstatic. I am so excited. Apparently, it doesn't have any music in it. Like, it doesn't have any like the, the songs, the songs that we all know and love. I'm depressed now. Yeah, because it's supposed to be more like the actual legend of Mulan. I'm still excited regardless. If I want to hear the songs, I can go back and listen to the songs. Truth, the truth I'm... hurts. Oh. So how do what do you how do you think of what do you think of the Brutals? What do I think of the Brutals? I think they're fine. I think they're just, I mean, they're really just the Koopa Kids incarnate, basically. I feel like they're the, probably the, my least favorite thing about the game. They're my least favorite part about the game, too. I agree. Because I just, I, I just don't, we don't need any more of these, like, you know, team of whatever that you fight repeatedly throughout the game. We don't need any more of that. Because we already have, like, this game has cool bosses. They I, think it made have more, I think it would have made more sense just to use the Koopa, the Koopalines. Yeah, I, the I agree with that, too. I yeah. just don't, like, I don't know. For some reason, I get, like, a hardcore Easter vibe whenever I fight the Brutals. Oh, my God. That's true. It does feel a bit Easter-y. I'm like, where's my eggs? Where's my candy? <laughs> where's my candy? <laughs> where's my Jesus? <laughs> where's my Jesus? <laughs> that's true. Jesus is a big part of Easter, huh? I, I kind of <laughs> forgot about that for a second. <laughs> I mean, that's the whole purpose of the holiday, but... This is the, okay. the whole purpose of the holiday. I don't know how I forgot about that. Yeah. Sorry, I forgot about you, Jesus. <laughs> I love you. Jesus. <gasps> oh my God, Illuminati. It's real, what? Josh. The Whenever, Illuminati. For some is reason, real? When, I, when I see this giant upside down, like floating pyramid, I, I, my mind just always goes straight towards the Illuminati. I mean, that's something Ill the Illuminati would do. What if? What if that's why Nintendo is doing so well right now? What if they sold their souls to the Illuminati? <laughs> I wouldn't uh, put it past him. I wonder what cousin Miyamoto had to kill in order to get initiated. <laughs> All of them. <laughs> he had to kill he... every every one of his cousins. <laughs> his good old cousin Waluigi. <laughs> I actually don't know anything about the Illuminati. That's like one of the like conspiracies. In order to jo join the Illuminati, you have to like kill one of your cousins. It's so it's such a random thing. So random. It's so random. Oh my oh, god, murder! Just, so <laughs> just some random murder to top off your day. <laughs> I love random murder. So that's how I get through my day, really. Yeah, that's why we added the euthanize. Black yeah, black. that's why. Yeah, just you know, just in case we wanted to kill something during the oh, course of this episode, oh, to satisfy our. Oh, why are you moaning? Oh, I'm feeling the HD rumbles, dude. Gross. <laughs> dude, the the HD rumbles they get to me. They tickle my fancy. Ew. I'm just, I'm just, I'm disturbed. Wah! <laughs> Sorry, that was. Oh, wah! That was Are you like disturbed. Oh, that was me trying oh, I get to it do now. It. I was like, because I said the word disturbed. I was like, I was, yeah, okay, wow, I get it now. Thank you for explaining the joke. It's way funnier now that you explained it. I was like, I just, this, I was like, this joke would be funnier with an explanation. That's my first thought. I just didn't realize it was the joke at first, and then I, like, halfway through talking about it, I realized it was the, that was the joke. I'm glad I have smart friends like you. Fuck off. <laughs> I don't like you anymore. Same, we're, I don't like you either. Not, we're not friends. We're not friends anymore. Oh. Ouch. So you know what my favorite part about this game is? What? The rolling. I like rolling. <laughs> I like how you can do a dive into a roll. I like you know, how you that can was... just roll from where you are. I love I'm it. I'm pretty sure the author of Harry Potter, that's her favorite thing about the game, too. <laughs> that's a good one. Good one, Tyler. JK Rowling. Good one. JK Rowling. <laughs> <laughs> a raffle. A raffle. Uh, yeah, no, it's a good time, man. It's a good that's, time. That's what Mario does when he laughs. He raffles. <laughs> 
he's just laughing while he's rolling. He's like, ah! I would do it. I would demonstrate it while laughing, but, uh... I why, mean, do I, my, why do all my I'm jokes suck? That. How do you come up with good jokes? Like, is there any classes? <laughs> I don't to think... Seminar. No, I don't think so. I think Damn you it. just have to be funny. Which you are not. Sorry. I, I, I wish you were, because that would make my job a lot easier. <laughs> Spitting some truth right now. Then I wouldn't have to hurt. Then I wouldn't have to work so hard. <laughs> well, I'm not, I'm not really sad. Rude. No, we both need to pause our game because we actually have already hit 30 minutes. Like, what the hell? Holy that was crap, 30. That have. was 30 minutes. That's insane. Wow. Holy oh, shit. That went my by so quickly. Hey, guys, I just want to say thank you all for watching this first entire this entire this first entire episode. <laughs> thank you for watching the whole episode. <laughs> thank you for making it all the way through. Thank you for not getting <laughs> disinterested. Thanks for not giving up <laughs> on us. <laughs> thank you for not Rick rolling us. Oh. Anyways, if you enjoyed the episode, please help um, support by giving this video a thumbs up. Let us know down in the comments what team you're on. We will be tallying up the votes and letting you guys know what team won in the next episode. Yep, and don't forget to go into the description and check out the links uh, to our Twitter. Go follow us over there uh, and tweet the hashtag Mario Odyssey versus uh, go, the link to this Go episode. follow my new Twitter just in case I never get my old Twitter back. Just in case. Just, Just in, case. in case. Which is what it looks like is going to happen. <laughs> Dude, all of my sorry, tweets. Tyler. I have so many tweets on there that I love. I'm so sorry. I love you, Tyler, but I'm sorry. It sucks. Yeah. Anyway, thanks for watching, everybody. We'll see you guys in the next episode of Super Mario Odyssey Versus. Love you!